I am Anil Kumar. In this video, we have four test questions based on scientific notation. Well, writing numbers in scientific notation is also called standard form in United Kingdom. We have four questions here. You are allowed calculator for solving these questions. Question number one. Write 0 0.436 times 10 to the power of 4 in standard form. Question number 2. Write 0 0.000000234 in scientific notation. Question number 3. Simplify using scientific notation. Express your answer using scientific notation. We have a complicated expression. You can use calculator. For this question. Question number four. Every atom contains negatively charged particles called electrons and positively charged particles called protons. Each electron has a mass of 9.11 into 10 raised to power minus 28 grams and each proton has a mass of 1.67 into 10 raised to power minus 24 grams. How many times as heavy is a proton than an electron? You can pause the video, answer this question, and then look into my suggestions. Now, scientific notation is writing a number which is in one's place from up to 9, right? So, 0 0.436 times 10 to the power 4 can be written as 4.36 times 10 to the power of 3, correct? So, it could be written like this in scientific notation. In standard form, we have to multiply it with 10 to the power 4 and the answer which you get will be 4360, right? So, in standard form, we get 4360. So, that is the answer and this is the the number in standard form question number 2 zero point all these zeros 2 3 4 in scientific notation so here you can see the advantage of using scientific notation right so we'll write this number as 2.34 times 10 to the power of what to figure this out, see the number is small and therefore this exponent is going to be negative, right? So what number should be there? Let us count the decimal places. We have to move 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and 1, 7. Since we are moving 7 places to the right, when we write 2.34, it will be times 10 to the power of minus 7. So that becomes our answer. Perfect. Question number three. Simplify using scientific notation. Express your answer using scientific notation. So this number given to us is what? Let's rewrite this. We have 5.229. Okay. 229 into 10 to the power of what? So we actually, this is a huge number. And we use the decimal right there. How many decimal places? 3, 3, 6, 3, 9, and 1, 10. So it should be 5.229 into 10 raised to power 10. The other number here will be written as we have to multiply by 9.5 times 10 to the power of. Now in this case, the power has to be negative. The number is a decimal number. We are moving this decimal 1, 2, 3, 4 places to the right. So when you move decimal to the right, that means you are writing the number with negative exponent. The denominator here is 4.8. Let's work out 10 to the power of how much? So 2 and 3, 5 and 2, 7, right? So, 4.8 into 10 to the power 7, right? that makes it that huge number. Now, as far as the exponents go, we could write this as 10 to the power of 10 minus 4, 
which is 10 to the power of 6, right? And then when you take away 7, we get into 10 to the power of minus 1, correct? For the numbers, let's multiply using calculator. 5.229 times 9.5 divided by 4.8 gives us 10 point, let's rewrite this, 10.3490. Let's cut it here, right? So that is what we get. So we get 10.3490 into 10 is to power minus 1. So minus 1 means it is 1.0349, right? So we can write it like this, and that becomes our answer. Is that clear to you, right? So it is already in the scientific notation, so we don't really have to uh, do anything more than that. Question number 4. Every atom contains negatively charged particles called electrons and positively charged particles called protons. Each electron has a mass of 9.11 into 10 to the power minus 28 grams and each proton has a mass of 1.67 into 10 to the power minus 24 grams. How many times as heavy is a proton as is heavy is a proton than an electron? So basically we are finding the ratio of mass of proton to that of electron, correct? So what we get here, mass of proton is 1.67 into 10 to the power minus 24 divided by 9.11 into 10 to the power minus 28. So as far as the powers of 10 is concerned, Minus 24 plus 28 gives us 10 to the power of 4. Now let's check 1.67 divided by 9.11. 1.67 divided by 9.11. That gives us in decimals 0 0.1833, right? That gives us 0 0.1833. Now we could write this in scientific notation as equal to 1.833 into 10 raised to power 3, right? So that becomes the ratio of the mass of proton to that of electron, right? So it is almost 1,800 times heavier than the mass of electron. So I hope that helps. Feel free to write a comment, share your views. If you like and subscribe to my video, that would be great. Thanks for your time and all the best.